So wake up guys, it's time for how to get Brewster. Let's get started. So you're gonna go in the museum. Now, what we're gonna talk about is Brewster, how to get the roost, the coffee shop, you know. We're gonna bring it to our islands. New 2.0 update. Here is how. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna talk to Blathers. <laughs> Hmm, ah, you know, he's always like, surprise, didn't see us, you know, so anyway, he said there is a matter he wanted to talk about, impeccable timing we have, yes we do, so anyway, he wants to draw more folks in the museum, so he wants a cafe, he tried to contact Brewster, his old friend, seems he's closed shop and nobody appears to know. How he's going. So, he caught wind of some newly unearthed group of gyroids. Now, Brewster, he's saying, loves gyroids. Like, he likes fossils. So, he thinks that Brewster's going after these gyroids. So, he wants us to search for them. He wants us to search for Brewster. That is the first step. He gave us a photograph of him. So do we know what he looks like. Okay, so he's telling us that these gyroids are found on the islands that Captain leads his tours. So, we need to go over there. That's our first step, guys. We need to go to Captain. So not only am I going to show you how to get Brewster, but we're going to show you Cap'n. So, here he is at his boat at the dock. That's where you'll find him. And if you want to take a trip, round cost a thousand miles. No more need for Nook Miles tickets. I am loving that. Don't have to go into resident services, buy a ticket, go into the airport, all that. This is super quick, super simple. Another good thing with Cap'n is you get a show on your journey. <laughs> Listen to these beautiful tunes. I'll let y'all enjoy that for a bit. They call these his sea shanties. If you are in a rush though, there is a possibility you can continue to click B and it'll stop his uh, singing. It'll make it go quicker so you can head to the island just automatically. Some other things you can do on the boat ride is do reactions with the A button and the X button and the Y button. Just to have fun with that. And then... After his song, you'll be at the new island. Right now. I'm so excited, guys. Each island you go to it has different features, which is really cool. Like, it could be a different season. It could be a different... Um, there could be different flowers there. Like, one time I went, this island was in summer. So, there were sharks. As you can see here, we have these flowers. So I'm going to grab a few of these to take back to my island. And there are bushes as well. On most of the islands I've been to, that Captain takes you to, there are bushes that you can take back. Which is pretty cool. Another feature on every island is a gyroid. So, you'll notice that there's these, the X's on the ground. So each island will have a gyroid. Another good thing is, they say that you never come back to the same island, which is one, one of the things we were having probably with Nook Miles tickets. It seemed like it was the same island sometimes. So, I'm, I'm excited to see all the different places that we can go to with Captain. Now let's get back to Brewster. There he is, folks. We see him. He's sitting over here looking for gyroids. So we have that's right, you know, Brewster asking him, does he know him? And he's like, you're looking at. 
So we're going to explain to him why we're here, what we're talking about. Oh, and look, he gives us a gyroid fragment, our first gyroid fragment. You can get that by talking to Brewster. And he, he, he's gonna, he explains exactly how gyroids work, just to get us started. Okay, so now we've talked to him. He's gonna come, he says he's gonna come to our island, so let's go back to the island. After, of course, we gathered all the goods from this one island here. Okay, we're back. So I went back to the museum and I went to go talk to Blathers again after meeting with Brewster to see what he had to say. Always sleeping during the day. Okay, so he asks us, are we still searching for, for Brewster? And then we can tell him, yeah, we found him, so. That's us what he said. He's gonna be here soon. Great. I'm excited, guys. He's coming. So he's gonna make arrangements in the museum. So to, the next day, after you find Brewster and talk to Blathers, your museum will be under construction. So you won't be able to use it the next day. Don't worry, that day will go by fast. And then you'll have the roost set up. Uh, so, um, then Isabel the next day she'll give you that announcement about that they're adding the cafe, that the museum is closed. And a little uh, announcement that Blathers wanted her to say. Alright, so this is that next day. I'm going to show you what it looks like under construction here. So we see they have the green cover over it. We can't see all the things they're doing in there, getting us, getting it ready for us. But the next morning, Isabel is going to tell us that the museum has a new addition, The Roost. I'm not going to be able to do that. I'm not going to be able to do that. I'm not going to be able to do that. I'm not going to be able to do that. I'm not going to be able to do that. I'm not going to be able to do that. I'm not going to be able to do that. I'm not going to be able to do that. I'm not
Of course, you can do your special ceremony by going to resident services about the opening of that. Hey, so I'm going to talk to Gladys again after it opens up. And he's going to tell me about how the cafe is open and where it is. And the roost is open day and night, 24 hours. Okay, so let's head over there. Here it is. They have a, a sign that says open 24-7. I'll slide right in there. Okay, here it is, guys. What we've been waiting for. Look at this place. It is so cafe style. So we have the dark wood floors, the green tiles on the on the walls, the green seats, the wood tables, even some plants back here. The details are beautiful. So over here we have where you can set up an amiibo and you want to sit in a seat and Brewster tells us that there is our reserve seating. So you can't sit over there and drink your coffee, I guess unless you have a guest. So we're going to sit at this stool. Coffee is 200 bales. Get us a sip of coffee. So cool watching him pour the cup. Scoop that over to us. How special. Hey, let's take a drink of this. Looks like, looks like my character took. Place is gonna be the Animal Crossing Starbucks. All right, so that's how it is. That's how you order your cup of coffee. And so over here, let's talk to Wilbur. So you, as you can see, there will be guests in here you can talk to. Like normally, you can't talk to Wilbur. You don't see him outside the airport. But he's in the roost, so it'll be special appearances like that. And talking to Brewster was pretty short this time around, but I think that soon enough he'll open up to us. So let's look at it through the camera. Let's look at these details. Wow. Okay. Everything through this new camera is so cool to me. Everything like I'm there. So we see back there we have all his ingredients for coffee making. And to the left in the back room back there you might can see some gyroids. The cash register. Some of his pictures. The amiibo station. Other nice pictures on the wall. Alright, so that's all, everybody. Thank you for watching. That is exactly how you can get roosters to your island, get the roost, and you can enjoy coffee every day and great association with the residents on your island by coming in here, seeing who's in there, and talking to Brewster. Okay, so. Please like, subscribe, and comment. Bye.